I've been going on well. All right, we'd like to say goodnight to our audience on KTN Home. We've been following this bulletin. You'll continue enjoying the rest of uh, the programming on KTN Home. The bulletin continues on KTN News. A total of 22 teams have qualified for the National Teachers Training College finals being held at the Machakos TTC. According to Davis Beria, this year's edition has adopted a new Olympic format. Day two kicked off with the men's soccer as Egoji Teachers Training College stormed in the finals by defeating Kaimose 3 2 in a penalty shootout. After the match ended in a 1 1 draw in regular time, Egoji will now face Mosoriot, who beat Shanzu 4 1. Mwenge Teachers Training College qualified for the men's volleyball finals with a three sets to nil victory over Kagumo and will now face defending champions Rachunyo, who won three sets to one against Chester. In the women's finals, Bondo will battle it out with Chester. We are sure of going to win the semi-finals and proceeding to the finals. Being that we are the national champs, defending national champs, we don't think there's any other team that's going to beat us. We will say with a lot of confidence that it's still our game, it's still our trophy, and we're taking it back home. I'm sure that Sumbi is a good thing. I'm sure that we are going to be a good thing, but we are going to be a good thing, to be a good thing. For the first time in the history of the games, a new format has been adopted. Now, what can you say me that uh, in the, the first edition of uh, the Olympic Games, traditionally to make to kiwa tuna tunafanya ball games tuna mariza tunafanya athletics tuna mariza lakini kwa mwaka huu tumeweza kulete kuunganisha athletics na tumeweza pia ku, kuleta ball games pamoja mambo ni tofauti despite the intense competition the games have faced a myriad of challenges going forward tupate hata usaidizi kutoka kwa athletics Kenya tupate kwa KVF Kenya Volleyball Federation, the Basketball Association, and all professional bodies. 41 teachers training colleges are representing different regions across the country in the national games. It will be a do or die on Wednesday as every team will be gunning to emerge champions in 11 disciplines to secure themselves a place in the East Africa Games scheduled for October this year in Uganda. Davis 